This is the new Ecodrift 15.1 pump. When you open the box, you have the controller, the pump itself, the adapter, power cable and a light sensor. Making all the connections is fairly easy. You make the connection between the pump and the controller and you plug in the power supply. With this controller you can really do a lot of settings. First of all, here on the right side you can set the speed. If you press the speed button, it will increase in steps of about 20%. When you continue pressing that button and you reach the 100%, after that it will decrease again until 20%. You also can choose which frequency you want to use. A constant flow, a flow for on and off, a slowly increasing and decreasing flow and a random flow. The increasing frequency between on and off or increasing and decreasing can be adjusted by this button. Fast means very fast on and off and slow means more time between going on and off. What's also new is you can make a Wi-Fi connection with the multi-controller which I will show you later. By pressing the A or the B button you can make that connection and in fact you don't need this controller anymore, at least not to adjust the settings of the pump. You can do that then with the multi-controller. Then you also have the mode and light button. With the mode button you can choose what type of flow you want. And with the night button you can also use a light sensor connected to this device. By pressing the speed and feed button for a few seconds. You can turn off the pump for about 10 minutes just for feeding your, uh, your fish. I will make all the connections now and I will show you how it works in practice. I made this setup to make it visible how things are working. Later on I will show you the pump in my own tank. Now you see the pump working at about 20% of its capacity and with a constant flow. By pressing the speed button, speed will increase. Continue pressing that button to the maximum and then you can decrease it again. You can also change the mode. Now it's on a constant flow. This is on and off, but very fast. You can change that by turning this knob. And then the time between on and off is increasing. Another mode is slowly on and off. Also that frequency you can change by turning the knob. And the last setting is a random one.
As I said in the beginning, there's also the EcoDrift Wireless Master Controller. With this controller, you can uh, connect through Wi-Fi to different uh, pubs. Be aware that this is Wi-Fi, it's not VLAN. And this device only works with the new series point one. So if you have an older one, you cannot use this device. In the box you only have the power supply and the controller itself. The controller looks very much alike like the standard controller, only you, here you have two panels instead of only one. Making the connection is very easy. Simply press the AB lock button until you see a blue LED. Now it's connected to the multi-controller. Whatever I do, it will not react anymore. All the controls need to be done by the multi-controller. So if I increase the speed now on the multi-controller, the LED will follow on the single controller. Hopefully, it's successful. I connected now the light sensor to the controller. If you then press the mode night button for a few seconds, then the night LED will go on. What will happen when you have that uh, sensor connected? As soon as when it becomes dark, the speed of the pump will decrease with about 15%. Which can be very interesting during your night period. Thank you. 